You found the correct video if, like me, you own Tesla stock but are unable to see or attend the company's shareholder meetings. What then happened during that meeting? What essential details should you be aware of? Answering these questions will undoubtedly increase your wealth, so let's do it now. We'll go over the main ideas from Tesla's 2023 shareholder meeting in this video. Updates on the Cybertruck AI research, humanoid robots, and numerous other products were noticed. Furthermore, we will talk about Tesla's future business plan. You're probably curious to know more at this point, so keep watching and tuning in. However, in order to activate YouTube's algorithm, make sure to like this video first. To remain up to current on Tesla, don't forget to subscribe to Tesla Stock News. Fresh from Tesla's 2023 annual shareholder meeting, I have some exciting news to share. It was definitely one for the books, I must say. The man himself, Elon Musk, was beaming as he revealed Tesla's long-term goals and made several significant announcements on new goods. Get ready, because this is going to get really exciting. Let's start with the Cybertruck. Later this year, this beast of a car is scheduled to come off the assembly line, and deliveries will happen soon after. Not only that, but Elon also made hints about the company's upcoming cars, a dynamic pair that he thinks will sell an astounding 5 million units annually. Speaking of lofty objectives. But hang on, because Elon said that Tesla's humanoid robot holds most of the company's long-term worth. That was the most astounding revelation. You read correctly, a robot that resembles a human. This movie will examine Elon's remark from a number of perspectives, demonstrating how compelling and assured he was of his forecast. It's intriguing stuff, I assure you. Let's dissect Elon's vision for humanoid robots and their potential long-term influence on Tesla's valuation in order to fully understand it. Consider it as pulling back the curtain to reveal the enchantment occurring behind the scenes. The first is Tesla's core product line, which consists of electric vehicles. The market for electric vehicles is enormous and is one of the largest in the economy. For Tesla, this represents the first phase or level one. It's not easy to start a lucrative electric car company. You have to scale up production and take advantage of economies of scale. Why? Because even though electric vehicles include a lot of complex components, including motors, batteries, and power electronics, producing these parts in small quantities at first raises costs, which makes the finished product expensive. Tesla has to sell a lot of cars, ideally hundreds of thousands of each model, in order to make a profit. This presents a problem too, since the first high prices stifle demand. There is a catch-22 scenario. Let's now turn our attention to Tesla's supremacy. The unspoken fact is that Tesla has easily taken over the whole automotive industry, not just the market for electric vehicles. Entering a market where Tesla already holds a dominant position requires a Herculean effort, regardless of whether you're an established automaker or a young electric vehicle firm. It's not an easy task, believe me, to deliver a car that is both truly appealing and competitive with Tesla's products. As an alternative, you may investigate market niches that Tesla hasn't yet targeted. But as time passes, these unexplored markets can become more and more rare. Tesla's approach of dominating the market is divided into four phases. The first phase is focused on electric automobiles, where Tesla has already turned a profit and is consciously aiming for several market niches. Their cars outperform rivals with their remarkable margins. This prepares the way for the next stage, which is fully autonomous vehicles or robotaxis. When compared to EVs, the market for FSD is far greater because it converts vehicles from being driven by humans to being driven by themselves more frequently. Tesla wants to provide a fully autonomous driving experience while making money off of the value it adds. Elon Musk clarified some of the possible margins for this new business during a conversation. Musk imagines a situation where Tesla may attain incredible margins. Imagine a car with the same cost but five times the utilization, resulting in margins as high as 80%, though he acknowledges this is speculative. There would be a huge shift in the asset value due to the considerable increase in revenue. But energy doesn't see the same kind of growth in consumption, so Musk thinks margins in the region of 20 to 30% will be steady. The energy market is the subject of the third stage. 
Musk highlights the expanding global need for energy by referring to the demand for energy storage as nearly unlimited. The market for energy storage is growing as long as battery storage. Physical AI devices such as FSD and RoboTaxis, the humanoid robot is a versatile robot that can be trained to do a wide range of jobs. Musk has long recognized the significance of it and believes it has enormous potential. Imagine if a robot with human characteristics could not only get into a car, but also learn how to drive. The capacity to drive alone offers a significant use case for fully autonomous vehicles. Nonetheless, there are hundreds of thousands or possibly millions of possible uses for humanoid robots. People are prepared to pay money or trade resources to gain access to the skills that a humanoid robot can provide in each of these use cases because they have value. Numerous factors contribute to the enormous market for humanoid robots, which makes it a very profitable and attractive field. A major benefit is that sales of humanoid robots could be far higher than those of actual autos. Humanoid robot production is less complex and requires fewer materials than that of autos, which lowers manufacturing costs. The affordability presents numerous prospects for extensive implementation and ease of use. Elon Musk, a trailblazing pioneer in the industry, has audaciously declared his conviction regarding the potential magnitude of this sector. In his ideal future, there may be an astounding 10 billion or perhaps 20 billion units of demand for humanoid robots. These astounding numbers demonstrate the revolutionary potential of this technology, which might benefit every home, business, and industry through the employment of humanoid robots. Furthermore, humanoid robots have the ability to generate income in ways other than those found in conventional sales models. Particularly, Tesla understands the benefits of subscription-based strategies. For a weekly or monthly charge, people and businesses can access and use humanoid robots on a regular basis by subscribing to robotic services. In addition to providing steady revenue streams, this creative business strategy builds enduring bonds with clients, encouraging loyalty, and making the most use of these cutting-edge devices. Therefore, by adopting the subscription-based strategy, Tesla stands to gain a great deal. Tesla can maintain its position as a major player in the sector by leveraging the enormous market for humanoid robots and the opportunity for recurring revenue. Elon Musk's futuristic vision and Tesla's unwavering commitment to developing cutting-edge technology put the company in a strong position to influence the humanoid robot market and change how people interact with robotics globally. Elon Musk recently gave a speech to shareholders in which he highlighted his great confidence in Tesla's long-term worth and attributed much of it to Optimus, the company's humanoid robot. This suggests that even though Tesla has already established a sizable addressable market for energy, self-driving robotaxis, and electric vehicles, the potential of humanoid robots considerably outstrips these industries. The total potential of the three primary markets is not quite as great as that of humanoid robots. Elon Musk appears to genuinely believe this prognosis based on his unwavering position. Elon Musk made a bold promise in the early 20 tends that most new automobiles sold would be electric by 2030, and this circumstance is reminiscent of his prediction. Many people thought this idea was absurd, but as 2023 draws near, it's generally accepted that Elon's forecast will probably come true before the 2030 deadline. Elon's self-assurance was derived from his comprehension of battery cost curves and the revolutionary potential of technology and creativity in augmenting the electric car encounter. Similarly, Elon seems to foresee long-term paradigm shifts based on his unshakable trust in the boundless potential of artificial intelligence and humanoid robots. Tesla is only getting started in the world of humanoid robots because Elon Musk has a very bright future for them. He thinks the car industry will undergo a revolution because to this technology. Elon has taken his family on a global adventure that will last four to five months, despite his hectic schedule. They are currently making a brief stopover in Hawaii before traveling to Korea, Central Asia, and then Europe. This trip is primarily intended to give his kids a personal understanding of the diverse world we live in. Elon wants them to have a broad view of the world and a thorough comprehension of the opportunities and needs that are present everywhere.
Elon Musk has declared that he will drive the Cybertruck on a daily basis, expressing his excitement for it. In the midst of speculation about Tesla's next offerings, Elon stresses that the time is not right for a product announcement. He does, however, reassure everyone that Tesla is actively creating new product designs. He discloses that two upcoming items will surpass anticipated standards concerning their design and Tesla built Optimus's motors, controls, and electronics because they believed off-the-shelf parts were insufficient for a functional humanoid robot. Because humanoid robots have specific needs, the world-class motor and power electronics team at Tesla took on the challenge of building specialized actuators. Since humanoid robots can easily use the software created for Tesla's completely autonomous technology, Optimus is now operating at unusually high levels. Elon Musk thinks that the potential of Optimus and the development of self-driving technology is enormous and is sometimes overlooked. He compares the hypothetical circumstance of a Terminator-like event to the necessity to avoid any potential risks linked with advanced robotics. He does stress that there are a number of uses for generalized artificial intelligence in the actual world, including humanoid robots. Elon predicts a time when more people will want multiple humanoid robots than there are people in the world. This technology might have far-reaching effects, and he believes that Optimus will play a big role in Tesla's long-term value. To sum up, Elon Musk is quite hopeful about the development of humanoid robots in the future and how Tesla will play a part in it. In his opinion, Tesla's foray into this industry is only the start of a revolutionary period. Elon is still committed to pushing the envelope of invention and transforming numerous industries, even with his current family vacation and the exciting new products that Tesla is releasing. That brings this video to a conclusion. Please remember to subscribe to Tesla Stock News and give the video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. We appreciate your time and we'll see you in our upcoming video.